Hello, I'm Sean Ganner, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about dividing polynomials. So if I was given this polynomial to divide, m squared minus 7m minus 11 divided by m minus 8, okay? Well, I'm going to do some long division here, so I'm going to write my m minus 8, and have it go into my m squared minus 7m minus 11, just like normal long division. So then I'm going to ask myself, okay, what times m gives me m squared? Pretty simple, that's just m, right? m times m gives me m squared. So I'm going to put just one m right here above our place value where m is. m times m is m squared. And then m times minus 8 is a minus 8m. So then what we're going to do is we need to subtract this m squared minus 8m from our numerator, from the parts above it. Well, m squared is easy. They eliminate, right? m squared, that was the whole point. They should eliminate. And then I have minus 7m minus a negative 8m, which is the same thing as adding a positive. So, or adding, um, yeah. And so if we think about it, if we just read this minus sign, minus sign here and make that positive, now we have minus 7m plus 8m, which is just m. So, now we have m right there. We bring down the minus 11, okay? And so now they're asking us, okay, well, we do the same thing. What times m gives me m? And at first it's like, well, what is it? Well, it's just 1, right? A positive 1. If we take a positive 1, positive 1 times m gives me m. So we have 1 times m, or 1 times m over there gives me this m here, and 1 times minus 8 is a minus 8. But remember, we're subtracting these, okay, subtracting them. So m uh, minus m is just 0, great, and 11 minus an 8 of negative 8, right? So that minus sign we distribute, we can put it in there like that. So we have a negative 11 plus 8 is a minus 3. Since we finished, that minus 3 is my remainder, and so my final answer is just m plus 1, what's written up there, minus that remainder over or m minus 8. And there we have it, our final answer. So let's recap. We were given m squared minus 7m minus 11 divided by m minus 8. So when I did my long division here, I took my m minus 8 and had to go into our m squared minus 7m minus 11. I noticed, okay, m times m gave me m squared, and m times minus 8 was minus 8m. I then subtracted the 2, and what left me with, remember to bring this subtraction, an m right here. Then I ask the same question again for the ones place. What times m gives me m, which is just uh, 1, right? So 1 times m gives me the m. And then we need to multiply by the minus 8 again here. We subtracted them. It left me this uh, remainder, which is a negative 3. That remainder goes up top here in our final answer. And we divide them by our m minus uh, 8 here. And so our final answer is that m plus 1, and I put the minus sign right there, minus 3 over m minus 8. 